Hello everybody and welcome back to Crusader Kings, where last episode we got big. Like, very big. Are we the largest empire now? We're not even an empire. Are we the- could we become an empire? Actually, hang on. Could we become an empire? That's a question we should ask. No. We have 43 out of 61 required counties in Mali. And we have 16 of 74 in Guinea. But even so, this is an incredible position that we find ourselves in. However, these guys are going to be pretty upset at us. And together, they might be fairly powerful. So, we're going to have to do something about that. Our overall mission is going to, of course, be to get ourselves into feudalism, right? That is going to be a big, big goal here for the next little while. In order to do that, this would need to be an organized trade. But there is also this one. We need to have 70% of all military and civic tribal era innovations. That's all we're lacking there. So we wouldn't actually have to reform our faith? Intriguing. So this would give us a legitimizing legend seed if we did it this way. We need to have this anyway. But this would definitely be easier to feudalize with. So what do we actually need for that? 70% of all military and economic. We have mostly economic right now. We're working on barracks that is 65 years out. And that's low because of development, right? So development is quite low at this moment. We can certainly work on development. I would like to consider moving our capital over to Kong. And we may want to do that right now actually. Some buildings may become inactive. I don't think that's actually true. So if we move our capital here, that will put our capital in the quote-unquote correct place for our Dujur Kingdom. So that is absolutely fine. Now we can promote someone else's legend, the custodian of the holy site. But our level of devotion is actually too low. Okay. So for now, that's not the biggest of deals. I am concerned about having vassal factionalism here. So we should probably consider getting some duchy level vassals out over this way. I think that'll be an important thing to do. We can't do kingdom level vassals, of course, but we can create this duchy, which will cost us some gold. And then we would grant that over to this guy. Now he's going to be very happy about that. There we go. And that gets that under our, under our control. And he'll be a little easier to handle. So we need a new chancellor. This guy can be that chancellor. He's very angry at us due to short reign and offensive war, among a few other things. Cultural acceptance isn't that bad. Below legitimacy expectations, though. That is a bit of a problem. So our legitimacy is low. And we should definitely work on that. So what can we do to bring up our legitimacy? Well... There are a few things that we can do. We can get, like, events, but for the time being, I think it's reasonably okay. We can ransom off some prisoners. That do doesn't help our legitimacy, of course. We can try to get some legitimacy via a spouse. But I think that mostly loses legitimacy unless you're marrying up. Which, there's not really anybody around here to marry up to. There are no Empire-level titles around here, right? So, that doesn't really do anything for us, unfortunately. I think for now, what I want to do is I want to keep working on duchies out over here. So, let's grab some duchy-level titles. Perhaps Wagadougou. And we'll get that going. That does gain us legitimacy to create these titles. So, I think that's absolutely fine. We'll grant that off over here, and then up over this way, there is the Duchy of Yatenga. So each of these is getting us 25 legitimacy. That is absolutely noted, and I'm going to grant this guy the Duchy title of Yatenga. Odd that this guy didn't go with. Ah, he's supposed to be part of Upper Gurma. Okay, I gotcha. So where are you supposed to go? Bobo. Sure. We'll create that title, and I'm going to just grant it to this person. But they'll have to fight with Jenny here, whether this is theirs or not. So that'll be fine for the time being. This doesn't really do anything, but that gives us all duchy level up over here. It's still going to be somewhat problematic for us, but at least now we have some potential loyal vassals out over this way, right? So that is all absolutely fine. I want to check in on our military here. This is all the same. Noted. 
We could certainly think about creating a worthy accolade successor over here, and that's probably a good thing to do. So we'll do that for the time being. Yes, there is a faction created against us that is deeply, deeply unsurprising. We knew that there was going to be a bunch of factionalism. Hmm, apparently our wife is our rival. That's awkward. And also awkward is if we die. I want to be clear about that, too. Our succession is currently Confederate Partition. Now, what would we need to change it to High Partition? Well, our powerful vassals would have to sign on to this. And we would need heraldry and feudal or clan government. Okay. So that's fine. We probably do end up wanting to go the clan route. And I think that is what... Oh, where are we? I think this will take us to a clan. That does say it'll take us to feudal government. Okay. Well, whatever. It doesn't really matter. Either way, they're basically the same. So it is fine. Now, we do need to potentially do some development in this tribal hold. We'll need some gold for that. And what do we want to do for that gold? Well, we're in a much better position in terms of our prestige. So we may want to drop our majesty focus. And swap back over to stewardship. Let's do it. So we're going to go that route. That brings us up to 16.2 income. That's pretty solid. We're on absolute tribal authority for now. And we just increased control down over here. I don't want to fabricate a claim. Hang on. Where's control? There we go. I want to continue to increase control in some of these areas. So we'll definitely work on that. We're at 91 here. By the time this finishes, this might be maxed. So that would be absolutely great. We do have some factions against us, but none of these are actually a big deal. So for the moment, our factionalism is under control. But specifically when we have a succession, yikes. I don't expect that to go well. So... What is our next goal, militarily? We really need to get an empire level title. That is absolutely a top priority. We are 38 right now, so we're probably okay health-wise. But we definitely need to get something here. So, what would that look like? It would probably look like taking over a chunk of Mali. We currently need... What is this? Uh, 18 counties? If, hypothetically, we were to take Songhai, that would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh, this is Dendi out over here. It would be 10. Okay, so we could definitely think about attacking Songhai. This would be pretty expensive, and we've already done our subjugation war for this lifetime. We could do a kingdom invasion. This would get us only a small chunk of it. This would be about five counties. Okay. Alternatively, we can attack out over this direction and go for, like, Lomba. So this would be a duchy level, right? The duchy of Manding. Oh, up over there. Yeah, that's de jure. Uh, we would end up wanting to go for, like, the duchy of Loma. I think this down here is not within the empire. That is correct. So we could definitely do that. We would go for... Yeah, these claims are probably not ideal. We would end up going for the Duchy of Loma, and that'll create a little bit of border gore. We'll come back and deal with that. But I want to clean up some of these little guys out over this way before thinking about attacking Songhai, I feel like. We've got lots of prestige at this time, and we are currently at still rather low legitimacy. Okay. So how much legitimacy do we need to get to level 2? Level 2 is 280 legitimacy, and we're currently at 200. So creating two duchy titles would get us there. What other titles can we create? We actually can create two duchy titles. There's this one up over here, which is currently not held by anyone in particular. So we could just create this. We don't have the gold for it, but we could do that. I think... On the other hand, we'll be better off to just attack down over here. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do a Duchy Conquer. We're going to take the Duchy of Loma. That's going to cost us piety. That's okay. We can work with that. So we're going to get that done. We're going to raise up our forces here, and we're going to go in and attack as soon as they are raised. Beautiful. An enemy ally does join. Let's take 100 gold here. There we go. We saved a fortune. Beautiful. And now, of course, we have an extremely powerful army compared to what else is here. 
So this siege will go very quickly. I would very much like to get some form of siege weapons. <laughs> that would be very nice. But for right now, we don't have any. So we'll just have to siege through this the old-fashioned way. They're walking up and th this is nowhere near enough forces to attack us. I'm not sure what their goal here is. They really can't contest this. So this seems absolutely okay for the moment. What are they going to do? Go siege over here? I don't care about that if they do. We're being raided up here. I also don't really care too much about that for the moment. Our daughter, huh? It does not result in an alliance. So no, we're not going to do that. I do want to go attack down over here. We're at 71% war score from taking their capital. So this siege will likely end the war. Hmm. We can lose 36 stress here. That would be absolutely fine. Yeah, we'll do it. So that looks very, very good there. We do want to have these uh, innovations finishing up eventually. We're just not doing very well in terms of our development, right? This is not growing at all at this moment, and it's ignored because we're tribal. So we need to get out of tribalism as soon as we can, but for the time being, this is fine. We're at four months left on this siege, and they are at four months left, so we really should go deal with their army. In fact, dealing with their army would likely end the war, wouldn't it? So we should probably just do this. Okay, go deal with that. That should be absolutely no problem whatsoever. Yeah, this should end the war. That'll get us 50% war score, so why bother with this siege, now that I think about it? Cool. So the war is over, and this territory is now ours. We gain the contested titles. Does The duchy gets destroyed here. Okay, winning this war does not grant us any legitimacy. Noted. That is absolutely noted. However, it does give us the access to the title, and that is, in and of itself, useful. So we're going to walk back over this way. I need to grant out these titles. We did gain legitimacy, apparently. How much did we gain from that? None. Okay. That was a lie. We did not gain legitimacy. So we're going to grant this out, and we're going to grant this out. We don't need to hold those ourselves. So I want to disband these guys. There's a hostile army nearby, so we can't do it right now. But now we can. Beautiful. And I want to create this duchy. So we're going to usurp the duchy. Usurping the duchy. It said that the duchy was going to be destroyed, and it wasn't. Usurping the duchy does not grant us legitimacy. It makes them lose legitimacy. So that is noted. In that case, we probably don't want to create this duchy, but rather... Create the Kingdom of Mali? Yes, that will gain us 50 legitimacy. So we'll do that. We're still going to be a little low here. We're at 250. And we need to get ourselves some cash to bring that up. So we can definitely ransom off some of these. We can also pardon our vassal here. And I'm going to do that. We'll grant that pardon. That seems okay. I want to ransom all of these prisoners. Looks good. That'll make us a little bit of money, anyway. Fantastic. So that puts us up to 101 gold. How much do we actually need to create these duchy titles? 125? So we'll have that very, very soon. That will bump our legitimacy up over level 2. I'm not sure what our desired rank is. Powerful vassals want us to be at 4, and regular vassals want us to be at 3. So we need a lot of legitimacy here. Noted. That is absolutely fine, but I do want to continue to do some conquest out over this way. So how close are we at this point to getting Mali? Well, we're at, six, we're at 46 out of 61. So we need, let's see here, 15 more counties? Sure. We can definitely attack this lady and do a conquered duchy, although these duchies are split, which is very, very awkward for us. That means that we're just going to be able to get one. Okay, so in that case, we're going to have to wait out a truce. We might as well get going on that as soon as possible. 75 prestige, or we can do 50 prestige. And we'll just head down over here. That'll be fine. So we'll raise up our forces here, and we'll just head on in. We're just looking to consolidate our empire at this point. We need an empire-level title before our succession. Otherwise, things are going to get very awkward. Which I mean they're probably going to get awkward anyway, to be honest. Okay, 
So we've got six months left on this siege. Looks good. Is this going to end the war? Probably not, but I'm going to go start up this siege over here. We do see these guys right here as well, which I'm going to send a small detachment to go fight them. Beautiful. This should have absolutely no problem fighting them. We'll just come down over here, chase them down. We're sieging in both of these locations. Absolutely no problem whatsoever here. Okay, so this should get us 50% war score. And it was actually only 36. Okay. So this guy is going to lose 100 legitimacy due to this plague. Well, we'll summon the physician. Okay. So where is the plague? I currently do not see the plague. However, we can enter seclusion at this point. Hmm. Where is it? This guy's got good aptitude. We'll take him. Beautiful. Well, for the time being, all we need to do is bump him onto control plagues. So that'll give us some plague resistance. And he'll get some prestige. It'll cost us 0.2 gold per month. I'm not too concerned about 0.2 gold per month right now. I don't know where this plague is. Okay, so we could do early prevention. We could go for a risky treatment or a safe treatment or do nothing. I'm going to go for the safe treatment. I have no idea what this plague is or where it is. And apparently it was successful. So we gained mild epidemic prevention for 10 years. Giving us five plague resistance. Okay. That seems reasonably fine. But I still don't know where this plague actually is. Stewardship perk is available. And we are going to grab, I think, Hergeld here. Yeah, that's about one gold per month. Excellent. With our forces raised, anyway. So we can isolate our capital or enter seclusion. For the moment, I don't see a reason to do that. This war is over and we'll enforce those demands as well as disbanding our troops. Fantastic. I would like to attack her again, but of course, we're truced now. And so that's the best we can do. We can't attack here either. But that does give us one county. One. <laughs> We need a lot more. 14, to be precise. So with 14 additional counties, that'll be fine. Where is this famine fever? Oh, it's up over here. Okay, I didn't notice that previously. It's spreading up the river. Okay. We'll see if it even makes it down to our capital. These things do tend to burn themselves out eventually. And with the additional disease resistance, it should hopefully be okay. But I think we're completely fine to continue fighting out over here. I want to look at the du jour lines real quick here. Okay. So we would need to attack this guy and only this guy and then head north. So that would end up being one of these duchies. So we've got this one, which will get us two counties. Or we've got this one out over here, which would get us three. This is de jure ours. This is not. So I think this is the better one to go after. Do we want to go after the Duchy of Casa? Well, yes. But how do we want to go about doing it? Well, this is even split here. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely going to have to be Duchy level. So we're going to have to go after the Duchy of Casa here. Okay. So that's absolutely fine. We're going to raise up our forces out over this way. I don't expect that plague to make its way all the way out here. Unless it's a particularly vir virulent one, right? <laughs> So we're just going to head in here and hit their capital. Cradled by sick sickness is our son, but this is not related to that outbreak. He's just sickly. So that's okay. And we'll keep an eye on the spread of this plague. For the moment, it doesn't appear to be spreading too much right now. I think it's actually just holding still. Spreading along the river, but not really spreading off of the river. Oh, we won a battle down over here. I didn't even notice there was a battle happening. We are above our domain limit right now. Why did that happen? We just inherit something? Yes. We have this. We want to grant that out. We didn't inherit that. We conquered it. Cool. So that's absolutely fine. We'll get rid of that. And we're just sieging his capital. That might actually end the war. But this sickness does appear to be constrained to the river. Primarily. It's a little bit off of the river here, but... It's not really going beyond that river. So it it's p potentially like waterborne or something like that. That'll be fine. It is actually pretty cool that it apparently models a waterborne illness like that. That's neat. I like that. 
So this guy came of age. Sure, he is rather a, a rather a large gentleman, but that's fine. We are going to finish up this siege in about 50 days. This could end the war, but it's not necessarily going to end the war. It did end the war. Fantastic. So we'll enforce those demands and disband our troops. These territories will, of course, need to be granted on out. And we're going to want to continue to get legitimacy here. So what is our legitimacy right now? 250. So we're going to need to make whatever we can from titles. We can usurp titles, but that doesn't actually help us. This would grant us 25. So the gold per prestige is the same for creating kingdoms versus creating duchies. That said, we don't have the cash to create a kingdom. So we're going to create the Duchy of Kabu for right now. And where does that end up going? Well, that is this duchy right here. So that goes to this kid. And we are going to grant him the Duchy of Kabu, which will boost up his opinion of us pretty considerably. Although, it didn't actually budge him. Okay. Well, we'll demand his conversion. Maybe he'll accept. I kind of doubt it. No, he did not accept. Well, that's fine. It's not the end of the world. So, taking a look at our empire title here, we are currently at 50. We need 11. So, that pretty much means, like, an attack on Songhai. I don't want to do this while this plague is broken out here. We could also attack up over this way. This is all still within Mali until we get up here. So, that looks reasonably fine. If we were to declare here... How many provinces would this be? One, two, three, four. That's not bad for a duchy level. We could do that and then an invasion of Songhai. That might get us there. But we need to move relatively quickly, right? We definitely need to get that done. So let's declare this duchy war here. We're going to carve him up a little bit. We'll clean all of this up later. We are definitely creating some border gore here. But we'll get that cleaned up later on. For now, our only priority is getting the empire title. So when we have a succession, yeah, we're going to lose some kingdoms. But... We shouldn't end up losing the kingdoms entirely. They'll still be within our territory, and that'll be a useful thing. We'll be able to, like, imprison and revoke and stuff. Okay, so that's all looking good. Uh, what do we want here? Apocalyptic cult. This is going to potentially lose us prestige. Okay, we'll root them out. I don't want to lose prestige. We are currently at 275 prestige, which is... Interesting. I didn't expect to be at 275. Actually, no, that does make sense now that I think about it. Our prisoner has consumption. Okay. For the time being, that's probably okay. But I do want to boost up some county control. Actually, these are looking pretty good in our territory. So that's not too bad. We might actually want to have this guy be working on organizing army to reduce the army maintenance. That seems good. We can extort our subjects. Now, where are our loyal subjects? And we're definitely going to do that. We'll increase the taxes, punishment, and... Why are they never grateful for what they do have? So we get 115 gold here. That will allow us to create another duchy title, which we are going to do. That is out over here, and that's currently held basically entirely by this fine gentleman. Which isn't ideal, but we'll give him some territory here, or rather the title. And we'll see if he'll accept this demand to convert, but he probably won't. Yeah, as expected. So I'm going to split this force in half. We're going to go attack Jolof here. And we do see their army up over here. I'm going to let this siege finish. We've got 59 days on that. And what do we have for leadership here? Okay, we've got a siege leader there. Sounds good. So we're going to send this force to go attack this army as soon as this is done. That'll net us 50% war score or thereabouts. We're, we might not stack wipe them, but it'll be pretty close to that. Three, two, one. Okay. Okay. In we go. So 21% from taking this location. This is actually a barony over here. Are you feudal? Hang on. He's tribal. Okay. He must have gotten an event to build that. Cool. So that would need to be sieged eventually as well, but we might finish it just from this siege. We're at 71% war score, so we did max out our battle war score. Sounds good. And it's very likely that taking his capital will end this war. Indeed it did. So we'll enforce those demands. And we actually just gained 50, 50 legitimacy from that one. So that sounds good. We are currently at recognized ruler 2 of 5. 
In order to get to three, we need to be at 480 legitimacy. We're still below the expected legitimacy, but this is better. So that's good. I do want to grant out these titles. We don't want to hold them ourselves. And we can certainly continue to create duchies. So the Duchy of Lona here will create. And that will end up going... Where is Lona? Over here. Okay, so that goes here. Gotcha. There you go. You can have that. Sounds good. Okay, so our legitimacy is now parked at 375. We need to get that up to 480 to get to level 3, and then our regular vassals will say that we are at the level of legitimacy that we should be at. However, the powerful vassals want us to be at 4, and that's the one that really matters. So we need to build up a lot of legitimacy, but this conquest is a good way to do that. At this point, we are at 54, meaning that we require 7 counties. Okay, we can definitely work with that. So that would mean an attack on like this guy. We can start to come back through some of these if these truces are up. They're not up yet, but we can start to come back through some of those soon enough. And then there's, of course, also Songhai up here. But our number of territories that we can attack grows, grows very limited. No doubt about that. A kingdom invasion on Gurma would net us one, two, three, four, five, six. So six plus one is seven. I know that's a shocking piece of news, but that would be seven. And that would allow us to create our empire title. We'll need gold for that, but that's a good sign. It is time to put a cut in here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And next episode, we are going to pursue that. You can leave your offerings to the engagement gods in the form of likes, comments, subscribes, and bell ringings. And a very special thank you to all of the channel members for making this video possible, including ALS Gamer, Shadow Wolf, Kintogan, Ali Lee, Upper Cumberland Gamers, Nick Smarty, Dimitri H, Punching the Microphone, Soccerman12 UK, and all the rest. And of course, you. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, you can click the join button down below the video. And as always, I will see you all next time.